I love Sailor Moon. She makes an appearance in all of my sketchbooks at least once. So let's find some of these versions. That was the very first one I ever made. Yeesh. But I tried. And I love the fact that I don't draw her correctly. I, I never do. This is why swatching is so important. Do you think I know what colors I used here? Absolutely not. But I love it. Look at that red. The skin color. The red. Ah! Somewhere in this video, I think maybe two or three times, I draw her as she looks. But this is going to be progressively worse as it goes on. Somewhere in there, you're going to be like, that doesn't... Who are you making? What are we doing here? <laughs> you know... That show was so progressive with their outfits. I can't think of another show that had that many different different outfits and they were all fire. There was not one bad outfit. This is on my TikTok. This is this literal snippet of me coming down, not with all the eyeballs, but I think this is one of the ones where I drew her the best. This looks like her. We didn't really screw around with anything. I even gave her a bow. Please don't look at that. Please don't. <laughs> okay, you know what? You looked. I know you saw it. <laughs> We're gonna keep going. That was it for the sketchbook. I honestly think she only makes like two or three appearances in every single sketchbook of mine. You know, at this point I was like, what if she had green hair? Gages. What if we made her look a little bit more rock? A little punk. <laughs> I like it. I think that looks sick. I think, you know, not every idea is gonna be a winner. You know this one? Actually, if I remember correctly, there's a reason I won't, I never published most of these drawings. I think they were bad. Oh my god, they were bad. They were bad. <laughs> they were so bad. This one was the best one to come out of it, but I remember getting discouraged and being like, oh, I'm only making monstrosities. Ew. So crazy because I only grabbed four sketchbooks. One is the one that I recently did and the other is just, just the first three that I could find. So this is the one that I did. You already know this is the most recent because her skin is blue. This is the closest to her actual design I think I get. I like the bun idea. I want her sins. Don't look at that on the side. I scratched that out for your own protection. I did a full body. Isn't she cute? I don't know why I like hide away from that. I like full bodies. I gotta keep working at that. I... I was just throwing down anything that I could think of. I like that one though. With the crystals, her deadpan look, you're gonna keep seeing that look. It's my favorite, if I'm honest. I don't like expressions. I like my girls mean. And um, I drew it twice because isn't it adorable? The crystals in her hair, the, the white hair, which is her best look for Sailor Moon, period. That was my most recent video on YouTube with my pointy eyebrowed OC. And then this one, it's just so crazy because how do you like and not like something at the same time? I think the design is simple and I like it, but the, the earrings, the up top Disney ear looking, it's too much, but it's not. I like this. Does that make sense? And then this one, she looks like a little brown bear. I love this design. I eat it up because she reminds me of that Pokemon, like Teddy Ursa, Ursa Ring. You know what I'm talking about. She's my little brown bear. I even put the moon there because it just reminds me of her so much. I used my Cole Erase in green and I just lightly erased it for the skin color, but I think we're just going for the pose really. Not much to be desired. Here, I love this one color. I don't even know what it is, but you're gonna see it like two, three, four more times. <laughs> I love this color. You know, I think I just used her as practice for curls. I think that's just the one thing that I keep, it just keeps recircling back. This one, oh wow. I like the hidden message, that's cute. Also, she looks like a marsupial. She does. I don't know which one, but she's in that family with that hairstyle. Okay, these are wins. Now listen, I told you they all can't be winners. Don't talk to me about that other one, but for this one... You know, I don't even think these look like Sailor Moon anymore. <laughs> That's okay, though. 
I think that's like the, the third time you've seen this one color. I can't let it go. I can't. You know, I think I just like this one so much because the hair is messed up. You've got messed up buns, it's stringy. Because all these fight actions and they've got little dirts on their cheek, but your hair is still perfect. These were the reject pile. I did not want to color these. You know, I don't, nothing in me. Sometimes you just don't make the cut. These didn't. And then of course I have two more full bodies. These make me so happy. I don't know why I don't draw full bodies more often. But look at her little dress. It's got, it's got the strawberries on it. You know how I feel about that. And sandals. She has cute little sandals on her feet. Come on. That had to have made you smile. The hair on this one is the best. Well, I'm not gonna get into that just yet. Let's start from the top. She's my favorite, the first girl. The second girl is whatever, but the first, she's, it almost reminds me of the colors of Flame Princess. If they made an orange Sailor Moon, I would watch it. I love the idea and I think her face is pretty. This one, I think the hair is the best, as I said, the coloring. I like that there's a lot of white, but the face leaves very little to be desired. It's not doing much for me. But when I tell you this green one is my absolute, she is top four. Look at this cute little full body. I gave her a tattoo. She looks so happy. I tried to put little leaves in her hair, or at least for the doodle I did. For this one though, can we just give her her flowers? I use so many different colors. I think it all just blends together. I, this is my best case scenario. This is, this is peak for me. Who's going to top this? I don't remember the rest, but who's topping this? I'm proud of myself for this. I think that's, that's top three. Definitely makes top three. Ooh, top three is about to shift again. Because this one I think is, there's nothing wrong with it fundamentally. There's just nothing right with it. Nothing in it is like, oh yeah, I'm so glad we picked these colors, no. Because the winners are right here. Actually, it's this one. Don't even look at the other girl. Look at that face. It's so crazy because when I'm not really trying and I'm just sketching, look how thin the line art is. Even around the eyes, I don't do the thick eyelash thing, but I just get so conflicted because I love the look. This is my ultimate sketch style. I'm so glad I didn't go back and try to touch this, but... Oh, I loved it. No, now this page is little to be desired. As cute as this idea was, it wasn't constructed correctly. My markers were going out for pink. The little moons in her hair should have been tinier. I would have had more. You can't really see the spikes in the top of the bun. I mean, good idea, poor execution. The girl in the middle is just trying her best to give her a break. Does it even look like we're trying to like even imitate Sailor Moon at this point because I see the hairstyle that's the same. Still, it feels like it's nothing like her. It's amazing. I love tangents. Now this one, my god. And this is so tough because one, we're just gonna start with this girl. These colors have no reason to not work. When I saw it, I was like, oh, the contrast. There's no reason this shouldn't look good. I don't know about you, but I do not. We're gonna try this again. Actually, I want, um, I want a character with these colors. <laughs> Why am I so stubborn? I even know what colors these are. You're gonna see, I'm gonna make a color. I'm gonna make a character with these colors. I don't know how I'm gonna make it work yet. This one, I think I made too curly Q. It, it looks like her hair's unhealthy. Yeah, there's little to be desired in that one. These two, I think that the colors are nice. Maybe I didn't blend them as well as I should, but she's beautiful. And I think that she still kind of comes off as, oh, it's the moon. The middle girl, absolutely not. Her curls are cute, don't get me wrong. That is, look at it. Give her her flowers. But doesn't this kind of scream like take me to Disneyland? Maybe it's like the, the bows or maybe it's the way that I drew the hair. I'm not sure what it is. I'm never gonna look at that and go, Sailor Moon. So that was it. Those are all of my crazy hair brain ideas. We started off really well in the beginning. They looked like Sailor Moon. See you guys next time. Thanks for watching.